Interventional radiology is a form of image guided surgery and what we do as interventional radiologists is we use x-rays, ultrasounds, CT scanners or even MR scanners to guide the equipment into parts of the body that surgeons couldn't normally reach without an open operation. So another way to describe us is pinhole surgeons. We make a tiny small incision in the skin, we can then guide a small guide wire and catheter through the arteries, through the blood vessels or any other tube in the body to where we need to provide focal treatment. The advantages of interventional radiology over surgery for treating certain conditions are that the patient can have a faster recovery, the procedure can be performed just with local anaesthetic, it can be performed in a very accurate, minimally invasive way. The reason we do interventional radiology is we think this gives the best outcomes for our patients. If we can do a procedure, the local anaesthetic, communicating with the patient, causing them absolutely minimal discomfort and minimal morbidity through a tiny little incision, that is by far the best way to do a procedure than doing a big open incision in a patient where you're prone to lots of complications, the patient could have bleeding afterwards, they could get infection. So we think this is the safest way to do a lot of procedures for patients. We can't obviously do everything for patients this way, but a lot of procedures that used to be done with open surgery can now be done using tiny, small incisions. For example, if a patient has a small tumour in their liver, which needs treating, and it can't be treated by open surgery, what we can do is we can go in with a very fine probe through the skin, into the tumour, and we can heat the tumour up and kill the tumour that way. And the patient can in fact go home the following day. And this, in small tumours, has been shown to have an equal success rate to surgery and a significantly lower complication rate. So we think for certain procedures, interventional radiology or image-guided surgery will give better outcomes for patients.